Hello everyone, I'm Luke Hanus. Um, I'm actually from Speed Invest, an early stage venture capital fund. I'm not the founder. The founder Paul has to apologize and I have apologized to you. He needed to go to London today for a big partnership meeting and he asked me to jump in. Um, unfortunately, I'm not used to pitches, you know, I'd rather watch them than, you know, do them my own, but I'll, I'll, they helped me out. They gave me a video to show you the product. So how was the video? Maybe a bit too long? You know, we lose our patience quite quickly, isn't it? So it's only 40 seconds. It's not even half the time that you should brush your teeth. And you know what? So do kids. They get bored after a few seconds. And the question is then what to do? You know, I don't know whether you're parents among us, but, but you, you, you want to look after your kids, so you, you push them to brush. You know, you hold them tight, they fight it. Because they're not rational, they are emotional, and then they spit the toothpaste in your face, and then they start crying. And a lot of parents cry too, and it's an awful situation. It's an incredible, awful situation. And it's horrible if it takes, you know, if it happens every second time. But what is the solution? You know, you, the solution is easy. You can go not so hard on brushing, right? Because they are only the first teeth. So when they're six or seven, they get the second teeth. It's not that bad. And at that time, we manage, you know, that thing with brushing. But then the problem starts. By the, eight, by the eight, um, age, when they turn six, seven, eight, when they got the second teeth, half of them already have cavities. And that's really bad because it could have been prevented. Families spend a lot of money on that. And also our society, the whole health system suffers. And funny enough, at the same time, we spend billions and billions on toys, you know? We, we want to get them entertained. We, we want the kids, our kids happy. So why don't combine that and try to use technology to trigger behavioral change? Labors developed a patent attack hardware in combination with the subscription model. It all starts with a manual braid brush or just recently released an electronic one. And then they get games and they're getting a brushing coach. And then they can buy up the subscription for premium versions, games, more statistics for parents, and also dental insurance. And then we deliver them toothpaste, toothbrushes, hats for electronic ones, you name it. Um, we conquered a bathroom. So we have incentives for everyone, for the parents and for the kids. Playbush did enormously well. They doubled revenue every year since launch. Uh, they had a big partnership with Unilever, you know, to get the trust in the market. Um, we now launched the uh, electric Playbush just a few weeks ago. You can order them online. And then the insurance case comes on top of it. And then the regional expansion. Now you can get a Playbush in France, UK, and the German-speaking world. The goal is to reach bathrooms, as many bathrooms as possible. 700,000 subscriptions would be great at 2021. Um, they have cool KPIs, you know, the current active user ratios are great, um, the split between digital and non-digital subscriptions, and also great renewal rates. So I think actually it's a quite, quite cool case. But there is one more thing. Like Playbush sits on a treasury box, and that treasury box is data. Data of brushing behavior. And you know what? We are the only one, because only also the big ones, like Unilever, or, 
you know, Procter, you name them, they don't have that. They sell through retail, they sell in the traditional ways. They don't know anything about brushable behavior, but we know because we collect the data every time a kid is brushing. So we can really work together with insurances and the health system to prevent the cavities rather than reconstruct uh, the teeth. So we, do, we did a launch with Unicor. Um, we tried to reinvent insurance, health insurance, especially teeth insurance, um, based on performance of brushing data, performance data, and that will determine the insurance plans, the premiums and rewards for kids and parents. Don't brush, play and brush. It's a great team, a great vision, operational excellence, and I think that Playbrush is really ready to conquer one million bathrooms. So I invite you to conquer it with us. Thank you.